Hello from Radio M100. Today we're going to show you how to install the uh, VMware on uh, Memphis Linux. And I have a YouTube website with some information that I'd like people to use and I used it 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 worked so you could listen to the video video says like whenever I first started there I uh, I did a mistake on this video here but uh, I mean on the other one I want you to copy and paste okay copy and now I want you to go to the uh, notepad they call it uh, K right in here okay paste it there you go we are ready to install our VMware okay now what we're gonna do we're gonna close YouTube don't need this okay we could save that to our desktop and say your desktop I'm just gonna put quick VM save okay now I want you to open see we can't get at it because the VMware is not installed so you have to use your control alt control alt Yeah, there you go. Click that. Now I want you to install the VMware tool. I'll give you the icon. Okay, there's the icon there. Okay. Now, once this is installed, I want you to control alt again full size this way you could go everywhere on the page here okay I want you to go to the console this is your shell your root shell I want you to type in su space separation enter your password enter okay now we're gonna follow our uh, little notepad here okay right with the Linux come on okay let's start by mounting our device I'm gonna plug it in just to see okay my USB stick is plugged in I'm gonna copy paste hit enter oh, it's already been uh, in use but it's booting up that's good okay now the next one is this one copy paste you could type in just to, to find out the version type in just the CP separation 
uh, space separation R space V M W A R E tools separation. If you want to know the version that you have on that machine, but now I already checked that. This is the version, so I want you to copy and paste. Enter. It takes a few seconds, and uh, I want you to copy and paste. CD separation forward slash TMP base enter now you have to enter this one here copy paste hit enter wait a few seconds it's gonna it shouldn't take too too long we're gonna do copy and paste again copy okay now again number seven now copy and paste Hit enter it's installing our VMware tool That takes a little bit. Doesn't take usually too too long. Oh, we have to hit enter after this. That's right. You have to hit enter. Sorry. Hit enter. It uh, rc six dot d. Hit enter. Enter. Enter our VM tool. Enter it's going to come up with uh, a few more uh, questions. You'll have to answer yes or no, and those are the important ones. If you don't answer, if you know this right, you'll never be able to install. Okay, now where are we? Okay, there's the uh, just popped up. Now, this you have to answer yes. Enter. Uh, this also. Yes. It's now initializing. Okay, this one here, search for GCC. Uh, answer is no on that one. 
enter. Uh, I believe this one is yes. No. It's, I guess it's no. Okay, that's right. It was no on this one right here. Uh, it was no. The path. Kernel. Header path. Okay. Now I want you to hit enter. Uh, you could read this. Hit, uh, hit enter. 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 You could take your time and read some of this. Enter. 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 I just don't want to enter something I'm not supposed to. Okay, this one is. I want to put the size that I want to use. It's 12. It's 1024 by 768. 1024 by 768. So this is number 12. Put number 12. Hit enter. And then it's asking you here, what is it? To create a new. Let's say yes. Uh, do you want to change the size? No. It's now installing. Okay, after it's done all that, we have to type in reboot. Reboot. Oops. Hit enter. And now that means we should have our VMware tool install. It shouldn't take too long for the uh, Memphis Linux to reboot. It's shutting down and then reboot. There you go. It's booted up. Now it wasn't too bad. Now it's going to come up and ask for our password. Oh, it's loading up. Sorry. And now it's rebooting. Once you know all your the commands, it, it's fairly easy to do, but. You have to know also the answer of all those questions. If you do one right, I mean one wrong, then you're stuck. So you have to be careful and follow uh, some of the uh, little instructions that we try to provide you. Hopefully, uh, this little tutorial did uh, help you to install that VMware and that's why well, after that is installed you you find out if you have dual screen it'll be uh, uh, that Memphis Linux it'll be married to the two machines uh, to the two windows it'll be married to 
to your Windows 7 and to your Memphis. Like right now I could go from window to window and I could copy and paste from one window to another. So now it is installed. Uh, thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed uh, that little tutorial. Till next time. Bye now.